Hello there adventurers, my name is Chris and today we're gonna be looking at something a little bit different. This time we're gonna be looking at something to help with sorting of the modules. And this is mainly aimed for DMs who run multiple games, multiple sessions, and each session with uh, a different module. And more specifically the module we're gonna be looking at today is gonna be this one. Tidy UI game settings. This does have multiple features, but we're interested in one in particular. I've installed a couple of modules uh, to test out. By the way, the module that pops up the artwork kind of needs a video in itself. It's image hover, and you can change the position or where the image is hovered. I just wanted to use it as an example. Right now, let's start with the first thing. First an installation. Well, we're simply going to be returning to the setup and we're simply going to be looking tidy Y. The module, the full name of the module is tidy UI game settings and is created by S D E N E C. Same as tidy, uh, tidy five E sheet. Okay, that being said, let's go back to the game world. It doesn't matter what system I'm using, because it is fully system agnostic. This video is going to be on the shorter side, so I won't keep you long. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and simply activate the module. This won't do much. We'll basically, uh, it will basically create a more compressed um, game settings page and let's simply save and the most important feature of it is going to be the import sorry this is going to be the export and the import button i let's actually let me do that again so save as a json file i'm simply going to create a copy on the desktop and let's say i do have another game with Yes, with a different set of modules. I'm gonna simply select here and there uh, other module. I'm gonna save and yes. Okay, I'm gonna go back and let's manage modules. And I'm gonna export again. Module list. This is going to be the second version. Um, this will come very familiar with people who are accustomed to mod managers for games like Skyrim, Remote, so far and so forth. Okay, now we have this module and we swap. Actually, let me. Okay, save, close. Let me actually change the game all altogether. I was in Foundry, uh, sorry, I was in Pathfinder, now let's swap to 5e. And let's say for 5e I do have one of those list of modules that were available. So I'm simply gonna manage modules, tidy UI, save, yes. And we're simply gonna import. So import JSON file, list one or list two let's go for uh, list one as you can see you're gonna have them here enumerated and simply hit activate module and save that's gonna be that if we go back to the manage module you will see them all of them activated so you don't have to do guesswork every time uh, you have this is uh, mainly focused uh, focused for people who have 50 or so module or even more but it works in, in even uh, more quantity right now we can also let me actually import import json let's add list two as you can see once again see it here activate and save and that's it i hope that you find this video useful and i hope to see you in the next video
Thank you so much for watching and if you did enjoy, please do consider liking and subscribing.